hi everybody sunburn and welcome to my channel kamala mood and i'm glad and on this channel see i spoke about reality shows a to align zanzi basis and i'm a recap so i'm a review you see up in the first school man i'm a celebrity is going to my youtube as a to align zanzi yo hi guys in in the basin by pale foot you're born a four moms and you're born everyone has that year that you wish you could just erase like back me erase and just erase it because it was the most challenging year ever i think mom zanel is full but this year 2022 is probably that year for you for her just when we think uh that uh tape Adult tape yeah, okay, umam Sanelis Fuba was dying down. Uh it looks like other people kept that uh tape and they have uploaded it in a number of adult entertainment sites, you guys. Not only locally but internationally as well. Like guys, once the footage is on those sites and there are so many of them, I can imagine if you can ever be able to trace it and remove it. And if it, it it makes a difference if you remove it, like he her grand children will be able to actually they they might possibly come across uh, this tape while they're just prior browsing around being naughty in their naughty times, you know. Yo, I I, I can't imagine how she's feeling. Anyway, you guys, the uh, South African has reported about this story, so we're going to go through it. And this was reported just yesterday by Ray, Ray Sileme. So it says Zanelis Fuba's leaked uh, video hits local and international porn sites. Okay, the Free State Legislature Speaker Dom Zanelle Zanelle Peters Fuba this explicit video has now landed on the most watched local and international porn sites okay and uh, according to as much as fuba's video which leaked in november broke the internet and depict depicts her undressed and indulging in an online activity uh is now on a porn site it was revealed that her video was released following the failure to pay money her ex-lover was uh, demanding you guys i'm wondering if the person that actually uploaded this video to those sites is actually the person that actually took the, the footage if it's that um lover that did that uh to to her so it says as much as reports uh, that the video was shared on porn sites by a user uh, with an unknown uh, name and has landed over 90,000 views. The video was shared on sites even after gender. Expert Lisa Verton publicly said that those who circulate the video will be fined. Verton added that people will be held criminally liable. Uh, sharing revenge porn and perpetuating abuse. Zimoja reveals that Sifuba took a much needed break after her, her video leaked. Her video was leaked and she attended therapy. She needed therapy. Yo! For the next five years, actually. The source revealed to the publication that the speaker's friends and family supported her through the humiliation. It has been hard for her and we are based in a small town where everyone knows each other. She is more embarrassed because kids have access to cell phones. Kids, kids nowadays are more advanced and they have internet. Most teens watch porn at uh, the source. According to social media experts, Emma uh, Sifuba can have her video taken down according to the terms of uh, Pornhub. I guess she is on Pornhub, you guys. ANC spokesperson Pule Mabe tells Simoja they were not aware of the video hitting the international porn market. However, they can't comment on the matter as it is her personal issue. We have nothing to say on the matter. It is rather personal, okay? Listen, I thought that, um, I can't remember which interview I was watching where somebody that works in adult entertainment was explaining that actually it's not easy on this side to upload footage that is not yours. 
that there is a lot it's, it's a long process to actually verify that whatever you are uploading on the internet you have permission to upload and that it is you on that uh, footage that you are up, um, uploading and that if it's not you you have permission to do it they actually they say that it's especially these big uh, sites that it's actually uh, the verification process my understanding was that it's very um uh, good so people are unlikely to be able to easily upload footage that is not theirs or the footage that they took illegally but this is proven to not be the case because uh, obviously i'm sure that uh, mums fuba did not give permission for this uh, to be uploaded to these websites i can imagine the nightmare just starting uh, all over again in her life anyway you guys that's all that i wanted to talk about today it's really an unfortunate situation that the story is not dying down and it looks like now and then she's just going to be dealing with this so please tell me what you think about this in the comment section please like the video and share it with your friends with your family and even with strangers in